Raise your hand when you're done. Raise your hand. Boom, boom. So it's finally Ugg season. I hope it lasts because today we woke up and it, the temperature in the house ran 64 degrees and I had the AC set to 70. So I had to switch that to heat because my husband claimed he was shivering to death. But yes, Uggs. And these are my old Uggs. I didn't even wear my new Uggs yet. <laughs> my regular appointment today to get my cervix checked and I had a high blood pressure reading this is the first high blood pressure reading I've ever had in my let alone in my pregnancy in my life I've never had a high blood pressure reading so they the doctor was concerned about preeclampsia you know I'm gonna be having a baby at 35 and I'm black so um, he was like, yeah, I think we need to send you down to labor and delivery and monitor, monitor you doing a, it's called a PHI, I want to say. And basically what they do is they draw labs and they hook you up to the blood pressure monitor and they monitor your blood pressure like every 10 minutes until you get your labs back. So he was like, yeah, you know, I'm predicting that you'll be home in a few hours, but if not, you know, we're, we're looking at tomorrow bruh tomorrow for what um to have the baby so you're gonna induce me if this doesn't go right uh yeah i'm like uh no so uh let's go in here and do this so we get this blood pressure down because this ain't uh this ain't popping so i've been looking at my few a few of my um my last few readings and um they all been low my blood pressure is back to normal and they got my urine back and it does not have protein in it which is a good thing, even though I don't know what that means. And now we're waiting on my blood work uh, to come back. But everything's looking good right now. My husband was just here, but he went to go get some something to eat. Because I'm hungry too, but you know they don't want you to eat nothing. So, um, I'm going to ask for a pops. Can I get a popsicle? Can I get something? Some chicken broth? Something. But, um, yeah, so that's about it. Yeah. 
got to put air in the tire? Yeah, these real, these real tires right here. Mm. Just use a bicycle pump though. It do feel like a toy though, don't it? <laughs> Let me see that. Like you got some intricate pieces up in here. Oh, this looks more complicated than the another one, right? Yeah. They got a base too, right? Car seat, yeah. Okay. Hold on. This um this was just That's for the car seat only, right? That's for with that stuff, right? Yeah. Oh, this is from mine. Yeah, which that's not yours right there? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Cause I'm gonna pull that stuff off the where, you, where are the instructions for this? In that full package. Oh, Dang, you're going to have to move your crest, huh? It's up there with the magnets, right? Yeah. How do the magnets stay on the wall, though? Nailed into the studs. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't. I think this one look more complicated. It really does. It's a lot of small parts here. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh boy. Dolphin stroller. These wheels plastic. Your stroller look way more legit. <laughs> Let me have that. Uh, those scissors right there. Has zip ties. And your stroller was more expensive than this. <laughs> do you pay for convenience? I don't think you do. Well, maybe you do. All right. Fold up. Fold or fold strap located underneath this pocket. Got this random bar. That's supposed to be there? Oh. Is this supposed to be here? Uh, I'm sure to sure that will be revealed soon. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Will it say fold, unfold on it? So, just stopped at the Dollar General. Um, my husband's going in there to get me a hat because he let me come out the house like this because I have my hair braided up for my wigs and I had a hat but um I don't know when we were walking out the door I just kind of left it so oh I'm looking rough looking rizz off but it's all good he was gonna get me a gas station hat but they didn't have no hats in the gas station I wanted one because it was probably gonna say something real country on it but um yeah so I mean everything all good got released from the hospital um had that high blood pressure reading but it's all good it was just one high blood pressure reading and all the labs came back everything was good and um they sent me back i'll see them next week day before i'm due so Woo! it's getting close <laughs> but i'm about to go walk on this treadmill though we just stopped at the fire station to see if anybody was there to see if we can get one of our car seats installed um, because the fire department installs them for you the correct way so we're gonna see well we had that all wrong yeah <laughs> but i mean it it doesn't really matter it's just a little bit safer to put the nail oh, okay I want to see. That's always marking where your little hooks are. Okay. Where they hook in the seat. Oh, okay. Push it in. Oh, okay. Let it snap. There's another one on the other yeah. side. Yeah. Oh 
I did not know. I've never even noticed these marks. <laughs> Me either. That's what there's a tall tail for. Wow. I didn't really pay attention to it until I started putting in car seats and then it's. You don't want more than two inches okay. either way, but as long as it's within that two inches, it's good. Try it now. 